Hi, welcome to automation testing that in in this video we'll see create custom keyword in Catalan studio as you we know that we have so many keywords in the Catalan studio to automate the application but sometimes we need some other keywords which are not available in the Catalan so you can create your own keyword and you can implement your own logic so we can use the same thing to automate the application for that you go to file new create a package and you need to create the keyword under that package and uh, you need to implement the logic for the custom keyword and the important thing is you need to apply an one of the annotations called at the rate keyword for your method at the rate keyword will make the method to custom keyword so without at the rate keyword it will not become a custom keyword so we'll see in action go to Catalan studio here is my project file new package I'll say com dot at automation testing dot util click OK. So under the keyword section you will find com dot at dot util. So now what I need to do right click new keyword. Here I need to give a name I'll say screenshot helper click OK. So it will create a class called public class screenshot helper. Now inside the screenshot helper you can create your own method and you can convert that method into a keyword. What I will do public void take web element screenshot and then I will say this is my method you can implement your logic. So this is screenshot helper under this take web element screenshot is a method but how it will become a keyword for that you need to apply one of the annotations called at the rate keyword. So once you save this one it will be available as a keyword. So we will see that whether it is available as a keyword or not. Go to the test case means file new test case I will name it as some sample test click OK so this is my test case I will add a web UI keyword sorry add custom keyword so you can find here you see com dot at dot util dot screenshot helper dot take web element screenshot this way you can use the uh, your custom keyword into inside your test case uh, that's all in this video thank you for watching this video please like us on facebook and don't forget to subscribe to youtube channel for further updates